Hello and welcome to a behind the scenes tour of Student Champs 2024. You might be wondering what Student Champs is. Let's go to Callum and he can tell you more. The British Esports Student Champs is the largest grassroots esports competition in the UK for schools and colleges. This year we've had over 800 teams taking part and today is the pinnacle of that competition where students are already arriving and we're going to see them shortly take to the stage for that final moment to see who will be crowned Nationals Champions. If your school or college doesn't have an esports team yet, why not? Click the link and get registered now. Here comes our fearless host, let's follow him to the stage. Come on then, follow me. It's only fair that I bring it through the pool door, not push door, push it this, and I ran into it. We don't talk about this. How are we feeling today, Connie? Pretty good. Uh, last two esports, so it's going to be quite an emotional one for lots of people. But mm. let's just say the Valorant, keep your eyes on that one. I'll be up there with Daniel later on today. It's going to be uh, easy the best final of the whole entire lot. Yeah. And what are we saying about this tie? Give the, give the people a tie. There you go, a little tie check. Mm. Bow. Fancy. He's so fancy. And the crep check too, if you want to as well. I mean, it's important to encapsulate the whole fit. The Exeter players have just arrived. Say hi, everyone. Hello. Hi, everyone. <laughs> And Callum. Hi, I'm gonna take them to the scrim rooms, let them settle in. Everyone, let's let's follow me. So Billy is now your sub. Uh, if you need a sub for Rugger League. <laughs> so I Billy is happy to jump in. She told me last night she's Master Guardian in Rocket League. <laughs> Alright, so Exeter are settled in. Let's go to the stage and see what's happening. Gary's in front of us. Gary, anything you wanna to say to the behind the scenes vlog? Yeah, it's gonna be a sick day. It's gonna be a sick day. This is our signage area. Come in, sign who you support. Um, I'm not gonna sign it, I'm just going to, but. Probably should be professional, right? Let's have a cheeky look behind the scenes. So this is where our players are gonna be sitting. They will be all here for Rocket League and Valorant, and they were here all day yesterday for Overwatch and League. So this is the, the North team side, and we'll go over here to the South team side. And the south sides are set up very similar. Much the same. But yeah, that's the stage. Right, so we just saw the players get their instructions on how they're going to sit on stage. Let's go back into the broadcast room and see see what's happening in there. Giving you a Right, we're going to have a look in the scrim rooms and see what the players are up to. Um, get a sneaky preview. This team is playing in darkness, um, so we shall see. So in here we have Confetti Arrows, and in this scrim room we have Odyssey EXE. Um, sneak preview. How do we how do we feel about today? <laughs> Feeling good, confident. Um, the guys are pretty excited. So. Well, I'm not going to interrupt your scrim because I know you're up. You're up next, but good luck. Thank you very much. <laughs> We're in the Exeter scrim room. They're having a great time. <laughs> Practicing pretty hard for Overwatch. They're up next on stage. I'm not going to interrupt them. I'm going to let them practice. And we'll see how it plays out on stage. Here we have head of ops, Alice. Alice, how do we think today is going to go? Easy. 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 Nothing but two O sweeps all day. No, enter entertaining games. We've got long games. Yeah, long, long games, long game, lots of matches, games. lots of fun, close, top eight. I mean, I think the, the Rocket League is going to be pretty close. Yeah. And, and Valorant. Valorant should be close as well, yeah, because yeah. there's a lot of... We want hype. Potentially pro players. All right, the plan now, guys, is that we are going to go get the other camera and go and do some player interviews. And that'll be on the other camera, so... Yeah, I'll maybe set this up and we'll give you a little sneaky behind the scenes. What a fun group. What a fun group. Alright, next up we're gonna go interview the Exeter guys. It's like you just copied their answer. Exactly, <laughs> nearly word for word <laughs> How are you doing today, Dom? I'm good, thanks. How are you? We're good. We're good. Welcome to BTS Vlog. Are you filming? Oh yeah. right, okay. Hello. I'm here doing some talent interviews, but I'll also do a recap for Esports News UK. Spoiler well. alerts for upcoming yeah. content. And I will say, Rocket League finals were really good. That was entertaining. It was, yeah. You know, I got to catch some of it. 
more reckless than the, the top level teams at the Rocket League Major yeah. the other week, but I enjoyed it. Yeah, it was very, entertaining. Very close very as well. Very very good to see a Northern team win as I well. Know. In the final. Yeah. Up next is going to be our Valorant show match, which has turned into British Esports versus the audience. So we'll go downstairs, we'll get some B-roll of that, and we'll see just how good the British Esports staff are at Valorant. I personally and it's down to Billy, respect up long range, no chance, flawless round and 13-2 for the audience, emphatic victory on that one Daniel. Yeah, he was dominant throughout, as much as British Esports were struggling to get a foot in the hold, they did still get a few rounds. Uh, we're trying to find uh, the MVP Dom, who won the Alienware MVP, uh, we're interviewing him, so let's go find him. There they are! Well done, I did, I did. Well done, well done. Well done, well done. Well done. Dom, can I interview you, please? So while we're backstage, let me just set you down a second. Let me just set you right here. Because I have just found some trophies. So, allow me to give you sneak peek at our Valorant Regional Trophy. Okay everyone, we are on to the last match of the day. Canel Cyphers taking on Burnley FCBs. Let's go down to the stage. As well, so it can be thrown onto the spikes to draw the position out. Once these shots have been yeah. shot. Going overtime! Hey guys, Editor Emma here. At this point, I realised I had to dash to the airport to get my flight back to Belfast. No one quite really expected both Rocket League and Valorant to go all the way, but that just goes to show the level of talent that we have on show here at Student Champs. If you want to know how the rest of the event panned out, make sure you hit that subscribe button and stay tuned because we will soon be releasing our official Student Champs 2024 after movie. There will be highs, lows and everything in between so look out for some high quality content coming soon and of course as cal has already said at the start of the video if you're a school or college and you're not taking part in student champs why not click the link down below in the description to register for next season student champs or if you want to know more about how esports and gaming can help young learners learn lifelong transferable skills social skills and of course have fun in the process then please do reach out to us as always guys, if you like the content, hit the like button. If you want to see more behind the scenes action of what British Esports gets up to, whether it's student champs or other events, leave a comment down below saying more BTS and we will do our best to make that happen. And of course, if you saw yourself in the video, you're legally obligated to share this all over social media. And as always guys, we will see you again soon.